The touch system accommodates a variety of sensors such as solid-state detectors, ionization chambers, invasive and non-invasive mass meters, DAP, and light. Since the touch system has the same connections as the AccuGold digitizer module the setup will apply to both systems. There are orientation dots above the connectors that indicate proper alignment with the mating connections. The multisensor can be pushed into the mating connector with ease. Align the connector dots then insert. To release pull back on the connector shell then remove the sensor. With the sensor connected it is recommended to use the AccuGold test stand when measuring. We will now attach the sensor to the sensor rod then place directly in beam of the X-ray machine. For additional stability you can retract the wings from the base. You can now make an exposure to capture a measurement. Cabled ionization chambers can be connected directly to the system. Non-cabled ion chambers will require an extension cable. Remove the sensor rod from the test stand base, and attach the chamber positioner block then set the chamber between the clips. We will now place the sensor in beam and make an exposure. It is recommended that the multisensor be used as a trigger source when capturing non-invasive mass for a more reliable reading but is not required. The light meter can measure both luminance and illuminance. To measure luminance we will measure sections of the monitor using a test pattern. To measure illuminance we will remove the adapter to measure the ambient light in the room. RADCAL provides a foam positioner block for mammography setup. Position the block on the detector chest wall edge then lower the compression paddle.
Leakage measurements can easily be done with the 180cc scatter chamber. Fixturing of the 180cc chamber is recommended for these sensitive measurements. It is also recommended that a solid state detector be used as a trigger source. For DAP measurements, do not place the sensor directly on the image detector as the DAP will read high due to backscatter. You can use the foam stand that is supplied with the case. For panoramic dental measurements attach the gap film to the image receptor on the center line. Make an exposure. You can now align the slot of the positioner base with the exposure line of the film. The positioner can be attached with tape or putty. Insert the multisensor onto the positioner base then place the mask over the sensor. Select the pan dental anode filter calibration so the software will provide the correct dose response. Some waveform distortion is normal due to the low signal level associated with this type of exposure.